Hey, what's awesome, up, everybody? So, it's to be awesome. Hey, doing? Hope you've got a great review on the world. Well, guys, basically, this is just me. My thoughts a little bit more on the post credit scene of X Men Days of Future Past. I think many people have probably wanted me to talk more about this because some people are a little bit confused. Some people don't get it. Obviously, some people that don't mostly read the comics like we do, like some of the hardcore, passionate comic book fans. Basically, what it was is, it basically showed, basically, N. Sabundo, aka, what, as you know, is basically means the first one, aka Apocalypse. This is basically showing him basically in ancient Egypt, basically, and um, it basically, because basically in the comics, in his origin, ancient, ancient civilizations would basically bow to him like a god and everything and he would basically and you know he basically put the pyramids together in the marvel universe at the beginning and you know everything and he's so so old apocalypse as you saw there was a cool touch with the the horsemen in there and they're basically teasing that the next movie is apocalypse and basically you know i am uh, very very obviously excited for this movie because i liked x-men days of future past a great movie and uh yeah very excited for x-men apocalypse but basically what they were mostly doing is they were mostly teasing that Apocalypse is the next big bad thing coming and yeah out of all the X-Men villains he is the most he is the biggest X-Men villain ever so yeah and obviously by Brian Singer saying that this movie is basically gonna be a mass destruction disaster movie it's basically like Godzilla basically so a lot of destruction and it makes sense because it's Apocalypse so leave a like and comment for your opinions subscribe for more videos and Marvel and DC fans subscribe to the channel for more videos to reviews and videos of all time and obviously I have more dates updates of Apocalypse, X-Men Apocalypse, the new movie coming in two two years time. Very excited about it. And to see one of the greatest combo villains come to life. And uh yeah, so basically guys, it was just a huge tease basically for the great villain Apocalypse. Bye guys, let me remember yours.